which may be paid by the banker as per standing instruction. Usually, but what we don't meet in our routine or in our daily practice, there are certain assigned duties to the banks, what they must do or what they must act on our behalf. They are called the agency function. This is given in commerce, the agency function. There are some agency function. Why it is called the agency function? Because to any account holder, the bank should do some functions on behalf of the account holder or the customer. Those functions are called agency function. For what purpose it can act as an agent? One to pay insurance premium to to pay electricity charges to pay Interest for a loan, interest avail, interest for a loan avail, periodically, it's a periodically, to pay periodically, this is, and we may function received by the bank to receive on customers behalf receive dividend receive dividend and to receive interest all these things receive dividend receive interest to receive insurance policy amount And these are all some receipts and these are all some payments which will be done by the bank on our behalf. They are called bank charge, bank uh, agency function. And for these activities, the bank will collect some charges for these functions. Bank will charge some amount, charge some amount, charge some amount means debited from the account automatically, debited from account automatically, it will not ask permission. Automatically debited for. For these functions, bank will charge some amount which is called bank charges. Bank charges which may be paid by the banker as per standing instruction. These are the three expenses. So, some amount called bank charges. Bank charges.
disease and what the interest on overdrafts that will pay on our behalf. This interest balance available in our bank account. For that the bank will view interest and offer all these functions and for these type of expenses the bank will collect some charges which is called bank charges and therefore for question number 4 you can answer any two of the three any two of the three that is the fourth question then fifth then question five A copy of customer's account issued by the bank 5A. A copy of customer's account issued by the bank. What is the copy of customer's account? issued by bank this is the first question then second question debit balance as per bank statement as per bank statement As per bank statement and C statement showing the costs. Statement showing the costs for difference in cash book and the passbook what is the answer for it a copy of customer's account issued by the bank bank will be the customer account will be a copy that is called what bank statement bank statement or otherwise it is called we are having the copy of it passbook we have it second one debit balance as per bank statement i should tell you something now in this case there are Debit balance Credit balance Here there are two types of books One is the cash book Shortly we write CD. Other book is the passport. Shortly we call PP. In the cash book, if it is a debit balance, it is a favorable balance. Favorable balance. And if there is credit balance in the cash book, it is unfavorable balance. Then, in the first book,
in the past book credit balance is the favorable balance and in the past book debit balance unfavorable balance otherwise called over drops this is therefore if you remember this one in the cash book debit balance is the favorable balance and then definitely credit balance and favorable balance then this is opposite for past book in debit balance debit balance in cash book is favorable then the debit balance in past book will be unfavorable credit balance in cash book is unfavorable then credit balance in the past book is favorable if you remember this one you can write the other three this this so what is given in the question debit balance as per bond bank statement debit balance as per bank statement then what it is it is unfavorable balance otherwise it is called overdraft see what they ask us to give substitute the following statement with one phrase or one word the first one for all the full sentence one word that is bank statement or passbook and for the debit balance as per bank statement is overdraft this is for the second one one word the full sentence is given in one word then the statement <coughs> showing the causes for difference in cash book and the past book just now i said in the beginning of this lesson what is bank reconciliation statement because of some causes or reasons the balance in the cash book and the balance in the past book may differ find all those causes that is reasons prepare a statement which is called bank reconciliation statement rather this is statement showing the causes for the difference in cash book and past book is bank reconciliation statement so for these long sentences we have found the short answers okay now at the sixth question we should say yes or no for this six a bank reconciliation statement is prepared prepared by the banker by the banker b adjusting the cash book cash book before preparing before preparing bank reconciliation statement is compulsory
C. Credit balance. As per bank statement. Credit balance. As per bank statement. Bank statement. Bank statement. He is an overdraft. Then D. Bank charges debited by bank. Debited by bank. Increases increases the balance increases the balance as per bank statement as per bank statement. Then E Bank Reconciliation Statement is prepared to identify the causes causes of Difference between between balance as per balance as per cash form cash book and these are all the three, I mean five questions we should say yes or no. Yes, we shall discuss it now. The first statement. The bank reconciliation statement is prepared by the banker. No, it is prepared by customer. Therefore, this is no. Only the reconciliation statement will be prepared by the customer. That is by the business, not by the bank. Adjusting cash book before preparing BRS is compulsory. What we must do? Cash book should be first adjusted. Then alone we can prepare BRS, that is bank reconciliation statement. BRS means bank reconciliation statement. Therefore, before preparing the cash book, I mean the bank reconciliation statement, the cash book should be adjusted. So this is yes. Then just now I wrote the reasons for this C. What I wrote? Passbook book 
fast flow, I mean cash flow, fast flow. The debit balance, credit balance. In cash book, debit balance, favorable. Credit balance, unfavorable. In passbook, credit balance favorable and debit balance unfavorable. So it is called the overdraft. We go to the point now. Credit balance as per bank statement is on overdraft. Credit balance as per passbook is a favorable balance. Only debit balance is unfavorable, which is otherwise called the overdraft. Therefore, in this case, credit balance as per bank statement is on overdraft is not a correct answer. Therefore, no, this statement is not correct. Then, bank charges debited by bank increases the balance as per statement when bank charges is debited what is the meaning of it just now i said the bank does some work on our behalf and that purpose the bank will debit some amount from the account that is it will withdraw some amount, it will take some amount from our account. Once the amount is taken from our account, the balance will decrease. Balance will decrease. If you the bank, the balance decrease. That is, bank charges debited by bank increases it is given. Not increases, it is it decreases the balance as per bank statement therefore increases it is given therefore it is no and the last one BRC is prepared to identify the causes what is the meaning of bank reconciliation statement I said sometimes there will be some difference between the balance in the passbook and the balance in the cash book maintained by the business. Silla Samaitla balance on the passbook leo, cash book leo, different term. But actually they must be equal. Equal I know. But sometimes other different term. What is the reason or what is the cause for it? Those causes are prepared as a statement which is called the bank reconciliation statement. BRC is prepared to identify the causes of difference between the causes of difference between balance as per passport and the cash book. So it is yes. And therefore, out of these five statements, A, C, D are not correct, whereas B and E are correct.